I'm Dr. Terry Orbach, The Love Doctor. I'm a therapist, a university professor, a research scientist, and the love doctor in the media. There's no one in the field of love who's done as much scientific research as me. The love doctor is with us this morning. I think after my first romantic relationship ended, I wanted to understand why. Why did he not want to be with me? Can lust be reignited in a long-term loving relationship? Absolutely. And most women are attracted to men who are wrong for them because they're looking for their opposite. That is the number one relationship problem today. Similarity and underlying values and attitudes is really what predicts longevity of relationships. I remember very vividly being in my car and listening to another relationship expert on the radio, and she was telling a grandmother bad relationship advice. So I decided that I needed to bring real, good scientific information to real people. I'm gonna share some secrets with you today, whether you've been together five, 10, or 50 years, that'll definitely transform your relationship into one that is new, passionate, and really happy. I met my husband on a blind date when I first got to the University of Michigan in Ann Arbor. I had 50, 60 blind dates in two years, but I knew what I was looking for. I was looking for someone just like me. The number one question I get as the love doctor, what happened to the excitement? Where did it go? Successful, happy relationships are pretty easy to understand. Number one, what are your expectations? Number two, is your partner willing to meet those expectations? Number three, if your partner isn't willing to meet your expectations, do you want to stay? I practice what I call the 10 minute rule. Mm -hmm. 10 minutes every single day, talking about something other than work, your children, who's gonna do what around the house, or your relationship. When we are happier in our relationships, we are healthier, that our heart health, we live longer. For more of the Love Doctor's advice, you can check out her website. Also follow her on Twitter, that's what I do.